The powerful gene editing CRISPR-Cas9 technique is a promising tool in the fight against conditions like retinal degradation, muscular dystrophy and HIV, but so far trials have been restricted to cultured cells in laboratory mice. Now the tool is being used in human trials for the first time, with a team of Chinese scientists injecting CRISPR-edited cells into a patient suffering from lung cancer. CRISPR works like a pair of genetic scissors, allowing scientists to cut very specific sections of DNA out of an organism, such as inherited genes that may lead to disease, and replace them with something more beneficial. Along with its potential to fight cancer and other illnesses in humans, the technique can be used in other living organisms for a variety of purposes, like pest control or improving the yield, hardiness and nutritional value of crops. The current study, led by oncologist Liu Yu at Sichuan University, is using the technique to modify immune cells of patients with metastatic non-small cell lung cancer, in the hope that it might boost the body's defenses. In basic terms, the immune system uses a type of white blood cell called a T-cell to detect and kill abnormal cells that may turn cancerous. T-cells have a built-in mechanism called Programmed Cell Death Protein 1, PD-1 that shuts them down when they're done, and one of cancer's crafty little tricks is to trigger that process early, weakening the body's immune response and allowing the tumor to grow.